the experience was like so heavily focused on service and just teaches us that this is how you win in the game of business an obsession with making an experience for people an obsession with serving them there you don't never say no to people as i, I traveled across europe uh, i was able to experience a lot of different things and different cultures and you know worlds that were like thousands of years ahead of us I was in a city called Lake Como the last week. The buildings are like 10,000 years old. Like they, they're saying like this particular building right here is from the 10th century, 1,000 years old, right? And this one right here was built in, I don't know, the year 900 something, whatever. Wow, right? Like it's incredible. A culture that has been around for way longer than us. And I got to experience different things from different parts of the world in Europe. One thing that I, I always like, I always learn something from, from these experiences business-wise. I get to stay to some of the best hotels in the world, at least in the, in the European part of the world. And the one thing that stands out is the word service, right? It's incredible how they are so interested in your experience. They're so interested in how you're doing, how you're feeling, taking care of you making sure that you are being blown away every step of the way. And I felt that obviously the lower you go on life experiences, the less interested there is in the quality of your experience. You know, yesterday I go to a restaurant, literally going to a place called the kitchen in safety Harbor, uh, good restaurant, nice restaurant, not that great of a service. They're not that interested in satisfying the customer in front of them. Uh, they bring me a bowl of, uh, fruits and i say listen my daughter only likes strawberries can you give me a bowl of strawberries no i'm sorry no we can't no no we can't do that i apologize i apologize right but you go to a place like where i stayed i stayed in a, in a hotel called il sereno which was incredible absolutely incredible for the last four days of the trip the experience was like so heavily focused on service and just teaches us that this is how you win in the game of business. An obsession with making an experience for people, an obsession with serving them. They're, you don't never say no to people. You don't say, no, we can't do this. That's beyond our scope. You figure it out, right? Like I see people go above and beyond. We are in the service industry. Our focus has to be blow people away. Blowing people away is not something that you're trying to do is to impress them. You're trying to do it to make them feel confident about the decision of working with us or giving giving us thousands of dollars you're trying to make people feel that we are the right decision some of these people that are coming to agm have been on a journey for five years before they give us a penny so for all of us to work together towards making that decision the correct one for them that's how you win in this game whenever you have a customer not feel taken care of, you are hurting a five year journey in many cases that are gonna lead towards that customer walking away with a bad taste in their mouth. And we have to have an obsession over that experience. That's why consistently finding out if we're catering to their needs and wants, giving them our direction, going above and beyond, giving them content ideas, giving them guidance, giving them like whatever it takes for those people to feel like, wow how did i get so lucky to find these people that's what it's all about that's how we win in the game of business and you guys should take it very personal because we are all in the service industry attention is something that i've i've had my mind set on since i was a very little kid i always wanted attention always always wanted attention not always for good things but i always wanted attention so it's only natural that i end up with a company named attention grabbing media because it was an obsession that i had i understood that that word was very valuable i want you guys to understand that this is not only valuable to your clients it's valuable to you so attention is a word that is very encompassing in any aspect of your life across the board on your family on a business on a group as an individual if you don't get enough attention you're not going to be able to grow you literally cannot grow without it. That's the only path to expansion, right? So getting attention, making sure that your good deeds are well known is how you succeed. It's how also your clients succeed because without attention, they will not be able to generate more business.